They're spreading an ounce of prevention from 15 ton salt trucks. All the trucks are loaded, the team's ready to go out. Cincinnati road crews gave problem streets the pre-treatment treatment and reloaded to be ready for anything that might come next. In addition to salt, they're also packing brine, that's salt mixed with water, and to make it all stick, they're stirring in some beet juice. You know, we're on call, we're ready to go. Hamilton County um, engineer Ted so Hubbard we're... says they're responsible for 54 routes. He says in addition to bridges and overpasses, roads like Ronald Reagan can be especially tricky in icy conditions. Ronald Reagan Highway, you have to watch. I mean, a lot of your east-west expressways ice up very quickly. In northern counties like Butler and Warren, ice is expected to be even more of a threat. Crews there trying to get an edge before it hits. And the potential for ice also has caught the attention of Duke crews. Ideally, we're hoping that this storm isn't going to be something that's going to critically impact our, our power lines, but we're definitely making sure we have crews ready. For now, crews can only wait and keep an eye out for ice. Now, the reason that they think that these east-west expressways freeze up so quickly is because the winds come in from the west. There's really nothing to stop it. It just shoots right down the highway. So if you're out on one of those roads, these icy conditions, Keep an eye out for it. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5.